Hello and welcome to the Amazon Fire 7 alternative uses for this small tablet which people have been using for web browsing, for book reading. I've managed to find some slightly more powerful things to do with it or more useful things to do with it. My usual setup which I'll be using in most of these videos is a Tech Gear Bluetooth keyboard. Um, it has a trackpad on it but if I get a chance I'll put my Apple mouse attached as well. Uh, moving the mouse and the keyboard has made the ads come up, so let's jump right in. I will sooner or later take those ads off, but we'll see how we go for now. You see I've got a simple desktop setup with the launcher hack on it. Now the first thing I want to do is show any Linux users out there that this thing's quite capable of running Termux. And what we want to do is just have a little session open and using the keyboard I will just install a package C matrix is a good one because it's good fun see how the tablet handles that you see it's reasonably responsive and then we can run C matrix locally and there it is obviously you can do more than that you can SSH into your remote machines if you've got Tmux on them, you can run multiple Tmux sessions. It's, it's, it's all useful stuff if you are Linux inclined. Now, if I could just get out of this, and the easiest way to exit a Tmux session is to press exit and go back to the menu. You'll see I haven't got many apps installed. Well, I have a few apps installed, but they don't show up. I've just got the basic browser, YouTube. I think that one's camera. Tmux on shape and Arduino Droid. I'll be going through all of those and uh, letting everyone know how they work. 